Tigers and lions and bears. Oh my. <laughs> A special 275-pound root canal patient for Dr. Burt Gaddis. American black bear, 18 and a half years old. Her name was Yum Yum. Three teeth treated in three hours as she laid peacefully asleep with her tongue hanging out. Was there any point during during the procedure you were afraid she was going to wake up? Never. This isn't Dr. Gaddis's first rodeo. He's performed dental procedures on several wild animals in captivity, like these tigers. Also river otters, gorillas. Hippopotamus with a team of folks and on the elephant on Buwagi with a with a team of folks. So I think the smallest was a fruit bat. If you've ever had a root canal, you can imagine what Yum Yum is going through. Here's a look at the teeth needing treatment. The procedure actually quite similar to a human. The tools a little bit different. This vial about the size used for a human root canal. This one for a bear. It just rotates, it just spins. And so that's about how much, 48 to 50 millimeters, which that's how long the root was in the bear. The end result, a much happier, healthier, and more comfortable Yum Yum after waking up. And of course, we wish Yum Yum the best of wishes on her recovery in the Montgomery Zoo. I'm sure she's a lot more comfortable now, but it was really interesting uh, talking to, to the doctor and just, you know, another walk in the park and the the range of animals that, that yeah. he has helped with uh, dental problems over the years and you asked the question i was wondering what if yum yum woke up i was concerned about you know do they ever wake up but he said hey he wasn't concerned he said i would be the first to know you see the, the mouth starting to open <laughs> right. and the eyes and i sure, He's out yeah, of there. you make sure that's fixed pretty quickly